Muy buenas y continuamos un día más con un rato con Shulato en Mass Effect Nos habíamos quedado en la Normandía que teníamos que ir a hablar con, con Joke Para que nos llevara a la Ciudadela Pero primero vamos a echar un vistazo por aquí Terminando que el correr me da mucha rabia A ver si encontramos algo interesante Hey, Ashley. ¿Qué me vas a contar? I'm glad you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Jenkins was a valuable part of this crew. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might not be here. Oh. You're a good soldier, Williams. You belong on the Normandy. Thanks, Commander. That means a lot from you. I've never met anyone who was awarded the Star of Terra. Oh, that's the yeah, Terra. Things were pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. It comes with being a Marine. But to see my whole unit wiped out. A ver, pues entonces ¿por qué? ¿Por qué te atlistaste al ejército si no quieres ver morir a gente? Couldn't have done it without you, Williams. Thanks, Commander. I have to admit, I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy. It's nice when someone makes you feel welcome. Estoy ganando muchos puntos de bondad, me parece a mí. Thanks, Commander. Joker's waiting for you on the bridge, Commander. Quiero hablar con todos. El Kaidan es el otro que tenía a mi lado. Glad to see you're okay, Commander. Este no me dice nada. El puente de Normandía. Podemos ir por aquí o podemos ir por aquí, supongo. Mapa de la galaxia Uh, otro códice A ver dice el, pres el Presley I'm glad you're okay, Commander Losing Jenkins was hard enough on the road Será para salir a la calle, ¿no? De adelante. A hablar con el Joker, a ver qué nos dice. ¿Te quiere matar a Batman? Yo estaba justo a punto de traernos a la Citadel. Ve el dinero de trabajo en el trabajo. A ver en qué plan el dinero dice. Sizes and everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower too. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach, transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Bueno, 
vamos a ver. This is an outrage. The council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony. The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Terminus. <laughs> well, yes. Seren, you can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action. You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Bueno, pues nada. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't Is like him up? being accused of treason. Seren's a threat to every human colony out there. If they don't stop him, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was Culpa destroyed. Nihilus, si no se That's Seren's fault, not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. <laughs> yeah, no. I ask her. Sure is peaceful here. This place is a little too perfect. Ah, sí. Something. Nos están escondiendo algo. No me lo no me lo puedo llegar a, a, a creer. Yo de mientras voy a chafardear por aquí a ver si algo. Mmm. Hendrix ha informado de lecturas inusuales de energía durante su patrulla por el cúmulo Argos Rock. Estaba especialmente preocupada por el sistema Ira, pero tuvo que volver antes de que su equipo pudiera investigar más a fondo. <coughs> no hay más patrullas programadas en ese sector. Debemos mandar un grupo de reconocimiento. Bien, bien, bien. Mm, vamos a abrir el mapa. Estamos aquí. Estamos aquí. Eh. Eh. No quiero moverte. Vale, vamos a ver qué hay por aquí arriba. Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. Your ambassador is next door in the large office. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Dan. <laughs> At least introduce yourself. I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is there something I can do for you, Earth Clan? Ah, sabe que nos cuenta. What is this place? You are in the embassy for the Volus and the Elcor. Your ambassador is next door, in his own office. In this shared space, I aid my fellow Volus when I'm not being interrupted. Qué mala leche. I'd like to know more about the Volus. I'm sure our history and culture would bore you, Earth Clan. Actually, I would like to know more about your history. My people came to the Citadel shortly after the Asari and Salarians had discovered it. 
We were instrumental ah, estos son los que manejan la pasta. Standardized galactic economy. However, despite our long association with the Citadel and our many contributions to galactic society, we still do not hold a seat on the council. La historia ya la hemos visto, ahora la cultura. Tell me about Volus culture. We are tribal by nature, but our ways are not violent. We barter and trade our lands and tribe members in order to increase status. Larger tribes often engulf smaller ones and eventually split again. Our society is very malleable, and our government is always shifting and changing. Joder, vaya cultura, ¿cómo han conseguido llegar a las Since we're not physically adept, we trade our services for protection. What is it you do here? I look out for the best interests of the Volus people. No easy task considering how often we are overlooked. Chastising rebuke, Din. The council favors your species greatly. You are naive. The Earth clan will be invited to the council long before our species will. Why aren't the Volus or Elcor part of the council? All species must prove themselves before they join the council. All but the Earth clans, it would seem. What is this? Dismissive. Ignore the Volus ambassador, human. He is incorrect in his assessment. Really? How long have we been waiting? How long do you think we'll continue to wait? Bah! This talk is wasted on the humans. Qué estúpido. You seem to have a bit of a chip on your shoulder, Din. You humans are new to the Citadel, and yet the Council has granted you great favor. <sighs> Chastising rebuke, Din. <laughs> your species has always been granted many concessions. Volus <clears throat> territory has expanded tenfold since coming to the Citadel. <clears throat> Details. We still have no real say in the decisions that affect Citadel space. Vale, voy a estar. Goodbye, Ambassador. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. Eh, por aquí. Este no podemos hablar. O sea, hablaremos con el chico. Hello there, human. Sincere apology, but I am here on business and cannot be distracted right now. You seem distressed. Is there something I can do to help? Alarmed response. You overheard that, did you? This is all going so wrong. And it is the Asari Consul's Jeez. fault. She's the one who started all this. Who's this Asari Consort? Curious. You have not heard. You must be new to the Citadel. Everyone knows Shatira, the Consort. The Consort. I cannot speak more about this problem. It is too sensitive. Suffice it to say, she has compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where can I find the Sasari Consort? She is across the bridge from here. Her offices are easy enough to spot. Good day, human. Thank you. Que voz más calmada. Oh. Tranquilo. Bueno, sigamos investigando. Ha puesto ahí el destino. No quiero el destino. Quiero investigar primero. Por aquí no puedo. Están al otro lado del puente, han dicho, ¿no? Está por aquí. Y aquí, sala de la consorte. Eh. Good day, Commander. The human ambassadors up the stairs, first room on the right. You know who I am? Yes, I receive reports on all newly arrived dignitaries and notable people. Oh, personalidades importantes. What is this place? 
This is the Presidium. More specifically, you are at the Citadel Embassies. If you have more questions, please access Avena. What's that? Oh, Avena is the virtual guide for the Citadel. Feel free to access the terminal yourself. Oh, What's your name? What do you do here? My name is Sephiria. I'm the administrative assistant for the embassies. You seem to be distracted. The embassies are the hub of all Citadel politics. <laughs> when you represent trillions <laughs> of citizens, it tends to get a little busy. Yes. I should be going now. Have a pleasant day. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. Vale, bien es esto aquí, ¿no? Greetings, and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. What does that mean? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence, oh, oh, programmed man. to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. Give me the tour. You are standing at Presidium Tourism Terminal 1. On either side of this lobby are the embassies of the various Citadel races, along with CSEC headquarters. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council meets regularly to discuss matters of interstellar importance. I want to know more about Citadel Security. Citadel Security serves as law enforcement for all regions of the Citadel, though the majority of officers serve in the wards. Executor Palin, a Turian, is the current head of CSEC, but individuals from virtually every species across Citadel space serve as officers beneath him. If you wish to learn more, Executor Palin's office is located in the CSEC headquarters just across the lobby. Okay. Tell me about the embassies. Each species in Citadel space important enough to be consulted on matters of galactic politics maintains an embassy on the Presidium. The Volus were the first non-council species to be granted an embassy, roughly 2,384 galactic standard oh, no. years ago. As Citadel space has expanded, more embassies have been added. The most recently added embassy belongs to your own species, humanity. It was added 19 galactic standard years ago, despite some rather vocal opposition. Why were people trying to keep my species out? Some species felt humanity was given preferential treatment. It often takes a century or wow, more before a new species is granted an embassy. The Council gave a great deal of thought to this matter. In the end, they decided humanity's impact on Citadel space was significant enough to warrant an embassy. Do you agree with their decision? I am not programmed yes. to make that kind of qualified judgment. My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. How come the Volus were the first species given an embassy? In the early years following the formation of the Council, the Volus were, apart from the Asari and Salarians, the most populous and widespread species in Citadel space. They established many new colonies and trading outposts, and they petitioned the Council for a greater role in determining interstellar policy. In recognition of their work to expand interstellar trade and establish a standardized galactic economy, the Volus were granted an embassy here on the Citadel. Why weren't they made a council race? The council races have extensive responsibilities. They must provide personnel and ships for the ah, Citadel fleets. They esa often gente provide no economic aid nada. in times of disaster. It would be unfair to demand such an enormous burden of a species unable to meet these obligations. The embassies allow lesser species to have a voice on the Citadel. That's pretty damn arrogant. I apologize if my personality has offended you. Please submit all formal complaints in writing to the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board. Do you know anything about specters? The term specter is derived from the branch of special tactics and reconnaissance. Each Spectre agent is hand-picked by the Council. Their primary role is preserving galactic stability and resolving volatile situations that cannot be handled through normal political channels. In this role, they are granted extraterritorial rights and jurisdictions. Spectres answer to no law or authority except the Council itself. Y por último, what can you tell me about the Citadel Council? 
Originally, the council consisted of representatives from the Asari and Salarians, the two dominant species in Citadel space. Roughly 1,304 galactic standard years ago, Turians were invited to join the Council in recognition of the role they played during the Krogan Rebellion. Since then, the three Council races have worked together to ensure the peaceful coexistence of the galactic community, while preserving individual autonomy for each species. It can't be as simple as that. There must be problems somewhere <laughs> in the system. I am not programmed to make that kind of qualified judgment. My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. Okay, then. Adios. Goodbye. Goodbye, and thank you for using Avena. Please enjoy your visit to the Citadel. Vamos a ver qué pone ahí. No, pero yo quiero ir a la consorte. A ir a la consorte por el otro lado. Sorte, hay que bajar las escaleras. Five times. Why? What do they want? How should I know? It's not like keepers offer an explanation for what they're doing. And yet, everyone just lets them go on doing whatever it is they do. <laughs> what choice do we have? If you try to stop them, they just shut down and another one replaces it. Just strange that we know so little about them. Not to mention frustrating. Me imagino que sean estos de lo que está hablando, ¿no? Hola, asqueroso. ¿No hablas? Welcome. I am Nelina. I don't recognize you as one of our expected clients today. Would you like me to see when the consort will be able to meet with you? Can't I just go in? Mm, I'm afraid not. Yeah, you must understand there are many who seek the oh. consort services. But if you wish to leave your name, she'll make every effort to meet with you. What do you do here, Nolina? I'm one of the consort's acolytes. Many of the people here today will not see the consort, but they expect to be attended to just the same. It's our job to ensure that they leave contented. <laughs> what exactly do you attend to? Well, each acolyte has her unique abilities. Some soothe with song, others with conversation. As much as possible, we seek to match the needs of our clients to the skills of our acolytes. My specialty is touch. My fingertips can find every tension point in your body. Ooh, eso! I'd like to try out your services. Excellent. I'll add you to our client list. We should be able to see you in um, three or four months. What is the consort? What does she do? Mm, it's difficult to explain. She's many things to many people and something different for each. Some seek her for advice, some for entertainment, others still for pleasure. Most of the time, our clients won't realize what they were seeking until after she has provided it for them. You make her sound like some kind of oracle. No, no. not in the usual sense. She's merely a woman. A woman with remarkable compassion claro, and a generous claro, spirit. Claro. I suggest you make an appointment and see for yourself. I think I'm done here. Oh, well, I hope you'll return again in the future. We always enjoy seeing new clients. Nalina. Yes, Shaira? Send the commander up to see me. I wish to speak with him. Yes, of course, mistress. Ah, mira, me han dejado pasar. Huh. It appears the consort has taken notice of you. She'd like to meet with you now. 
Where do I go? Just head upstairs. She'll be waiting for you. Thank you. Ah, por ahí. ¿Va a hablar con alguien? I see even the humans find the consort irresistible. No, claro, si te imitan. This is my first time. Welcome. It is a pleasure to see you. You're with the Alliance? My brother's a private back on Earth. Y... Tu hermano seguramente estará muerto. Ah, por favor. Bueno, pues ya estamos aquí. Ah, vamos a ver qué me cuenta la tiparraca esta. That is close enough, Commander. I've heard a great many things about you since your arrival here in our citadel. What exactly do you do? That depends on your needs. I offer advice to some, comfort to others. I have a certain problem that could use your expertise. Tell me about this problem you're having. I have a friend, Septimus, a retired Turian general. I won't discuss the details, but he wanted me to be more oh, than I could be. Uno que se We had a falling ella. out. Now he spends his days in Cora's den, drinking and spreading lies about me. If you would speak to him as a fellow soldier, I believe he will listen to you and let the matter be. What happened between you? I respect his privacy too much to go into the details. If he wishes to tell you what happened, that is his prerogative. What exactly do you want me to tell him? Appeal to a sense of honor. Remind him of his position as a general. If you can convince him to stop spreading lies about me, I will be very <laughs> grateful. Now I must ask you to take your leave. I have many clients waiting to see me. Vale, ¿y puedo robarte algo o no puedo robarte nada? Oh, ¿cuántos puntitos de virtud tengo? Soy un buen tío. Aunque por dentro sea el mismo demonio, pero... <coughs> vale, y ahora dónde tenemos que ir? Por ahí. A ver, ya tengo dos misiones. Ah, 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 en general es en el anto de Chora. En los distritos inferiores. Anto de Chora. Oh. Supongo que habrá que coger el. El teletransportador ese. Pues no, no hay nada por aquí. En los distritos inferiores, ha dicho. Esta gente no puede hablar. Y por aquí. A ver, el emporio este. Human, this one is greatly pleased to see you here in my decadent emporium. Who are you? This one's face name is Delaninder, though many in this place simply refer to it as Delan. Este. Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase, all of great worth. Eh. What exactly do you sell? 
Only the finest and most luxurious items that credits can buy. This one is able to procure almost any item the human would desire, for a price, naturally. Why do you refer to yourself as this one, <laughs> it? For the same reason that humans are so inquisitive. It is part of our culture. Specifically, Hanar only refer to themselves in the first person with family or oh, intimates. Look at the end, no? And we rarely do so with other species. It is just our way. Who are you? This one's face name is Delaninder, though many in this place simply refer to it as Delan. Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase, oh, all of great worth. Show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. You will not be disappointed. Oh. Oh. Ah, bueno, mira. Podía comp comprar una horrible. Ah, comparar. esto oh al ah, oficial de la normandía eh, no. Ay, vamos a salvar y vamos a hacer una pequeña pausa y enseguida volvemos sed buenas sed felices vemos